What's up you Molin investors and money maker welcome back to the channel when we talk about Molin and many other penny stocks we are looking for some positive updates here is my updates we are waiting to get back on that 10 billion dollar Saudi deal by the way Molin is doing great this morning I wanted to provide you with pre-market update and some sentiment because sentiment is really really important I have been watching reddit and we have been seeing a ton of momentum on reddit take a look right here Molin due diligence mega thread and Molin is one of the top search ticker on market watch at 6 a.m. Eastern take a look this were the top search ticker on market watch as of 6 a.m. Eastern time this is just before 46 minute as you can see on my screen and Molin is right underneath Tesla so there is a strong momentum going on take a look at on stock tweets we are looking pretty pretty bullish in terms of the sentiment score the sentiment score for last 15 minutes extremely extremely bullish as you can see right here the sentiment score is overall is extremely bullish as well last 15 minutes 2.08 right now it's 2.20 on a an average sentiment score one day we were strongly bullish but last couple of hours we are extremely extremely bullish the message volume is extremely high 3.41 that's the last score in last 15 minutes it's extremely high high as well with 34101 and one day we were slightly high you already know why we were extremely bullish right now Molin after our pre hours right now we were at 12 cents right now we are at 11 cents we're up 20 percent I can show you real quick the volume before hours and uh, that's really exciting to see right here and I can refresh the screen and you should be able to see the updated volume so the updated volume right now before for market hours remember Molin is a Nasdaq traded entity pre-market volume 63.5 million which is, which is pretty big we hit almost 1250 1270 take a look we hit 1270 we were up 21 22 percent and right now I believe we are seeing some of the buying volume some of the people are selling don't forget you can buy or sell Molin in pre hours because it's a Nasdaq traded entity this volume 63.8 as we speak the volume is going through the roof and we were up already 21 percent last friday we are up again 20 percent pre-market right now 10.69 percent and as you know it's constantly changing there is a strong momentum if you think about 60 million compared to t245 million we are already 30 percent of the transaction volume let me show you real quick what it looks on my screen 247 million is the average Average volume we already have 30 percent of its volume just in pre hours we had a huge 723 million in volume by the way do hit the like button we need 200 likes on this video so we can reach to more and more people 10 billion dollar worth of deal you already know that Lawrence had a live stream yesterday and I kept you posted I posted um, a video around that as well because this is looking super stunning they are talking about 10 billion dollar um, PR that is coming today hopefully it is coming today again I do not have a crystal ball and you want to do your own due diligence but Molan is looking super super exciting at the moment people are talking about 20 30 40 cents it is three four five x return on your investment but i'm extremely happy because many of my viewers and investors they invested in molin around at the end of march we saw nine cents i precisely talked about the stock and we hit 16 cents just in a matter of three days it's 65 percent return on your investment so congratulations to you if you bought it again i spoke precisely molin when it was eight cents and guess what from eight cents we hit 12 and a half cent which is 50 percent gain just within 24 hours or not 24 hours friday and monday monday morning three hours one day 50 percent gain so congratulations to you don't forget to subscribe to the channel and make this channel as part of your due diligence so you don't miss out on very juicy information now what's happening right now right 713 million in volume guess what what happened when it was nine cents in the past so 400 and 
52 million and we were at 9 cents on March 28th. We hit 765 cents and guess what? Our price point was 16 cents. So the history is going to repeat itself once we start seeing volume today. Molen is going to skyrocket in my opinion. Again, I'm not a financial advisor nor I'm a certified professional. So at the end of the day, do your due diligence because that is very important. But, but I want to give you this information pre-market so you can decide. Many people will start waking up and they will buy more than at 15, 16, 17 cents, but you want to come up with your own exit strategy. What I'm trying to say is when the volume is high, when the sentiment is high, when we see pre-volume for this kind of stock that spike, spike through the roof, and when we see a lot of people talking on Reddit, when it's one of the top search ticker on market watch, so on and so forth, you want to really look into it. By the way, the Molen, Molen was lacking just a big, big positive PR, which we are expecting, which is $10 billion. I'll be sharing that within a second, but you want to understand there is a high short volume ratio. That's number one. Cost to borrow, 52.77 on Friday. That's a pretty high short volume ratio. Take a look right here, what we see on off exchange. Off exchange, short interest uh, is 52.77, 158000000 on Short interest on float is pretty high, close to 8%, 7.86% and 1.21 day to cover, which is short period of time. Now, the cost to borrow is pretty high as well. So the stars are perfectly aligned for the squeeze. If you think Molan is going to squeeze, write down in the comment section below what price point do you think if you're part of a bull party, write down bull in the comment section below. If you think 20 cents can be achievable today, write down 20 cents or whatever you think in general. But once again, when you have a high, high possibility of PR like $10 billion PR that we already know that Molan already searched on the deal of Lawrence, right? Like they talked about um, the $10 billion contract with Saudi Arabia and there will be some PR. There is no PR as of this video I'm recording right now early on Monday morning. But this is exciting because the joint, they have the joint venture, Molen Advanced Operations. And I'll tell you MAEO, what you need to confirm and what you need to keep an eye out. But the Global EV Technology founder Lawrence also teased a $10 billion Saudi Arabia deal. Now, what is important? What is, what are, what is the secret sauce that people are talking about 10 things to know about Molen's MAEO and I want you to also keep an eye out. Number one, Molen has plans to equip all this commercial and electric uh, vehicle, consumer vehicle with the EMM new technology that they're talking about which is most efficient from operation standpoint as well as the battery standpoint which is going to revolutionize based on what Lawrence tells us. Now we'll have to confirm what this 10 billion dollar deal means, what is the time frame, how long it's going to take, what what are the conditions and when Molen can start delivering based on some of the things that I've seen on Reddit and also on Twitter and I posted in my previous video as well yesterday that it could potentially be within two to three weeks that they can start production. Now these are all speculations and this kind of speculation happens and you also want to be careful that people may will uh, buy the rumor and sell the news type of a thing. So do your own diligence at the end of the day. But one thing for sure, all I'm asking you is hit the like button so we can can share this video and information with more and more people. So go Molen. If you believe in Molen, hit the like, hit the subscribe and make this channel as part of your due diligence. Second thing, Molen announced the US provisional patent. This is very interesting because if they get this patent, they can also license this patent to Again, this pattern is universal technology. Anyone can use it. And this could be a billion dollar deal on the top of what's happening. So they have already filed this EMM patent. We will we'll need to see when it's going to get approved. Under the letter of agreement or LOA, EVT also has agreed to license MAEO technology. Previously known as better life enhancing technology with ever charged technology with an EMM. Again, energy management module and it as well as it has related IP rights. Now, you want to remember Molen owns 51% of this newly joint venture, 49% goes to this LLC. EVT also has licensed MAEO with all the rights to contract, government contract, purchase orders, and you can think of all the juicy and very interesting details and contracts that you can think of that we have been talking about. Number five, it is still an exception. EVT has the right to grant limited exclusive license concerning this technology to a third party, specifically for UAE. 
which is what we have been talking about the Saudi deal for 10 billion dollars I can't wait until we hear that we are expecting to hear maybe this week as soon as Monday and I'll keep you posted which is why we are building momentum let's take a look what Mullen is doing right now 11% up let me just go ahead and refresh and we should be able to see again there is a huge volume let me go back and check the volume as well for you oh we were talking about 60 million or 63 million when when i start the video take a look we are 80 million which is already 20 about about four so 40 percent of the total total average volume right 245 so 20 times 4 is 80 so close to that we already have almost 3x 3x the average volume on friday so average volume 245 friday we had 723 so that's huge 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 volume that you can you can expect today as well as part of going back to maeu as part of this agreement molin will pay pay uh, fifty thousand dollars to lawrence and in addition they'll pay five million dollars upon the completion of this specific agreement and that agreement also can be part of this overall 10 billion dollar deal that they're expecting from saudi arabia one of the things that Molan really, really needs is some of the revenue. We know that in Q1, they're expecting, and again, it's a speculation, but they're expecting about $37 million in revenue. And if this revenue kicks in, let's say a billion dollars, that is going to be astronomically, astronomically high for, for Molan. Now, with this IP and MAEO, definitive agreements have not yet to be licensed, so disclosed. So we'll see when they're going to license, how much money they're going to make, so on and so forth. Molan itself will invest $5 million in MAEO to run this business operations. In live stream, Lawrence mentioned $10 billion contract with Saudi Arabia. And that is already agreed upon. Think about it. It's already agreed upon. And I'm hoping for more details today. I'll keep you posted. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Make sure you hit the like button. Molan and MAEO not had, have confirmed any existence of such contract. So we'll keep you posted. Thanks for watching. I will see you in the next video.